Hi Libra, welcome to my channel Libra. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Libra sign. Thank you so much Libra for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Libra for being here. If you would like to further connect with me Libra, please click the bell and click the subscribe button, okay? Let's look into your weekly collective reading. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know what is the guided message for the Libra sign? What can I get for the Libra sign? Please? We will pick up love, career, money, and general situation. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Please don't forget to click the subscribe button. Let's look into the past energy, the current energies, your focus, your situation. What's coming towards you? I'm going to be doing some energy check in. And then let's see your immediate future. This is for the Libra sign. What is the guided message for the Libra sign, please? You have the Temperance card. You have the Justice card. The Empress card. The Nine of Cups, the Four of Cups, the Six of Wands, the Ten of Pentacles in here, the Queen of Cups. And so, let's start your reading, Libra. So, you're starting the reading with the Temperance card, the Six of Cups, and the Justice card in here. Um, it feels like this Temperance card, the Six of Cups, this is a past energy. This is someone in the past that you admire. You admire them. You have a crush with them. It feels like romantic. It could also be... It feels like very romantic with the Temperance card and the Six of Cups in here. Like you admire someone. You always look at their web page. You always look at their social media. There is a sweetness and... There's something sweet and very romantic about this temperance card and six of cups you have um i don't think this person you know the temperance card and six of cups if this person disappointed you like heartbreak i don't think so but if they did you probably have moved on because the justice card in here but you've got this it could be multiple people in here because this looks like the phone, and there's so many cups in here. So it's possible, Libra, that the past energy, you were into dating and getting to know, but you have a specific, you specifically admire someone, okay? That you've got this specific person that you think, and you look them up online. If this is not a person, you could be shopping online. Like you could be looking into something that, you could be viewing things that you want to buy, places you want to visit, things that you want to do. There is something romantic and sweet and loving. And if this is not like romantic, like you are visualizing what you want to have, what you want to do, what you want to experience. And you keep looking into that online. There's a digital presence in here. Like, okay, like you keep hyping up yourself you keep visiting this online shop, this travel, this airline, this hotel, this travel adventure. It could also be like you keep looking into jobs, okay? But it's um like the Temperance card, the Six of Cups. It feels like it's not intense. It's more of like I'm admiring you. I want this. Like you're, you're hyping up your manifestation. You're energetically connected to the following information places people energetically and manifesting it and hyping it it's sweet it's driven it's ambitious and it's romantic so it's not very dramatic it's really good okay yeah the page of swords you're specifically searching someone online you're looking at their photo or if this is this is this is a special person here there's a special person that you would like to reply respond or you would like them to give you an attention, you know, the page of source. But I don't think you're desperate. It's like, oh, you're so cute. Like, this is my, I admire you. It's it's that vibe, okay? Not really desperate, kind of. 
half yeah eight of cups you know and you have an ace of cups in here ten of wands i think you're creating some sort of vision board as you as you go online you're building up digit like as you go as you go towards like as you go online browsing you build up images and that images it connects and build up visually energetically to where you want to go so unconsciously libra ten of wands you're building up your vision board your vision diary you're ambitious you're exploring maybe the type of person that you want to date you could also be checking someone but it's a visual digital energetic build up of admiring exploring like it's exciting it's like okay this is this this is good okay i want to visit this if this is on sale oh this job is good like you're visually and energetically imprinting and there's a manifestation as well so you're a libra you are in curious like you're romantically curious intuitively excited and curious okay like um you know like look at that you haven't made a decision yet okay but whatever this one is it's going to lead you to falling in love with whether it's looking for a job a person like manifesting a person attracting a person or going to places but this is visually digitally energetically curious exploring fun like you're feeding your soul with what's what's the next thing that you want to do or who you want to date or you're attracting manifesting someone back but it's it's very open you know it's very it's not desperate it's just fun like okay you know like and i don't think you do this all the time like a specific time of the day that you visualize you connect and you explore it's very romantic it's like um it's good it's good vibe it's like you sit like you enjoy it you sit in a corner with your coffee and you visualize okay this is good you bookmark it like this is my next thing to do next thing to visit explore and at the same time you keep lo looking at this specific person and thinking about them and manifesting them and attracting them in the hope that if we connect we will visit together this place or somehow this is the person that will inspire me and i hope i fall in love with this person or with this type of person so it's all curiosity like intuitive creative and very curious and romantic too so no drama okay it could also be the the advice of your higher self to you to you to you uh libra is that no drama just be curious you know just be curious and at present you have the empress card so you like being curious look at that you could be into, I don't know, there's something with your energy that is inviting and you're really making the most of your time. You know, it's possible, Libra, that you, you know, it's possible with, you know, with the previews, I think there was a very stressful cosmic movement in the last three to four months. So right now, you look at yourself where it's more relaxed, it's more stable. If there are some people who disappointed you, you move on. You're the Empress card. You're looking for your next adventure. You're looking for your next challenge and you're looking for your next person. So you feel like this is the time where you sit and you do your creative objective. Uh, you manifest the person that you like. It's, it's, it's an Empress vibe. It's like this is where Shesta, you know, it's, it feels like you sit and you just relax because you know, who knows, the universe might throw you again with another challenge and you just want to recoup, relax and reward. Very nice. So you are the Empress card. So it's going to build up. I feel like with the Empress card, the nine of cups in here, you know, this could be your wish is that can I just relax and just think about my next adventure, the next person I'm going to date, the next challenge, the next thing. Can I just relax here? And in the next couple of days, you will be able, you're, you're going to enjoy this, I would say. I love seeing you sitting in the Empress card and creatively manifesting the life or the person. And I feel like this Empress card and the Nine of Cups, I could feel like, you know, you are going to very soon, very soon with the Six of Wands. Because Six of Wands, this is online. Buy it now. Connect. Um, apply. 
try it. So this is the actual action that you would do with all of those research, curiosity, manifesting, viewing. So there's a lot of that that you're doing. And I feel like it's very balanced because after this manifesting, attracting, viewing, uh, looking it up, researching, curiosity, I feel like after this buildup of energy, it makes you excited. It makes your uh, energy solid. Then with the Six of Wands, decision time. Like the decision that you make over after this Empress card, Nine of Cups, is something that you are confident and you definitely will trust yourself, your instinct, without overthinking of, of it because it went through something romantic. You know, like you're romanticizing your life again. You're making yourself excited again with things to do, things to explore. Even the way you look at challenge, you are wanting to not overcomplicate it. It's like, let's just solve the problem. Okay? So soon, six of wands, you will make a decision. You know, I could feel that this that you will be able to come up with after viewing, you know, exploring curiosity, you will come up with something in here. Okay, this is relax, nine of cups, relax, six of wands. Okay, it's time to do my decision. So, naturally, you will be able to decide what is your next travel adventure, what is the next thing that you explore, will you follow up with that person. In here, you're going to do something. You're going to make a, you know, you're going to, you know, the decision that you're going to make over, it's great. It's romantic. I'm really getting like a romantic vibe. Or it's something that will influence your life for the next three, four, six months. Because I feel like it's a something buildable. Okay, okay. This is what I'm, this is what I'm going to do in the next two weeks. Like you're already building your sk schedule for some of you guys. You're starting to build your schedule you're starting to feel where you're going you're starting to feel who who you will be connected it's something in your energetic flow that you're getting ready with what's the next big thing and that's gonna pile up within the viewing looking lurking researching manifesting in here this is gonna build up this is gonna build up something is gonna build up it's gonna solidify and you're gonna make the decision whether it's buying looking for a job or dating it's gonna build up but right now you're enjoying it you know some people it's like i want to travel but they're very stressed and overthinking where do i want to where do you want to go you enjoy it you know empress card nine of cups in here so you don't overthink the process yeah your 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 creative instinct is like dora the explorer you don't overthink the process you just keep on looking keep on connecting and then confidently taking an action taking a decision so enjoy this very relaxed very balanced very balanced yeah knight of wands see you are an explorer libra the explorer you know this knight of wands this could also be a person that would be attracted to you because you're an empress okay with the m the, the knight of wands in here yes oh it's coming from the past so as you navigate this exciting busy visualizing you know, exploring, exploring, no rush, no overthinking. I'll find what is my next big thing to do. Um, you have a knight of wands. Something is going to keep you busy, your curiosity, your time. And out of the blue, this knight of wands from the past is going to connect with you. Okay. Oh, seven of wands, six and seven. So this knight of wands, it could be one of your crush, one of your admirer. Um, but it's from the past. It's coming from the past. It looks like there was an improper breakup or maybe this is not an ex. It's not very dramatic. It's more of maybe there's a bit of falling out between the two of you. If it's not a friend, if it's not a lover, it could be a friend. There was an improper falling out between the two of you. This is number seven. So they'll definitely reappear in the month of July. If not, it could be six to seven weeks from now. It could be around the time of your um, birthday because this is number nine. But your wish to meet someone, explore places, your next challenges, your next upgrade, it's piling up in here. Like it's synchronizing well, you know. It's like you you have no stress. It's like when I feel it, I'm going to buy it. When I feel it, I'm going to do it. When I feel it, I'm going to follow up. When I feel it instinctively, I'm going to take an action, okay? Look at that, four of cups, no rush. 
this is you you you're viewing online you're viewing love in the center of the reading is your rose which is like you're not stressed okay if i feel this i'm gonna call them if i feel this i'm going to buy it if i feel this instinctively i'm gonna apply if i want this i'm gonna inquire so you are surrounded by thoughts plans objective aspiration creative you know thing that you want to do it's circling around you you're not overthinking you're feeling your instinct which one do you want to prioritize it's fun i feel like it's fun it's very fun okay now what else is coming towards you in the immediate future so between now probably up until the end of 2024 with this build up as a result of that unexpectedly you could get a money raise you know for some of you guys because of your curiosity with job or with job out of the blue you could be hired you could be not looking for a job but there's something that you would try experiment it could be a job it could be a business but you might get hired by somebody i'm also hearing the word you know what because you're open and curious but no pressure you might get hitch i'm hearing the word hitch so you could fall in love with somebody you could found love unexpectedly you could find something to fall in love you'll discover something to fall in love you'll discover something unexpected and you're going to fall in love with it if it's not a job that will pay you well and then you're going to fall in love with it it could be an adventure that you'll stumble upon oh i love this it's going to give you an inspiration it's going to make you feel inspired or it could be a person but you'll you're going to stumble upon some stability some inspiration due to this curious nature okay i love your vibe you're exploring it's really good keeping yourself busy no overthinking no stress just loving the freedom of the flow libra thank you guys for supporting the channel this is your reading i will see you soon you have a great day libra bye bye